This is the Trump Breaking News Network. Here's what's happening. Confirmed. Donald Trump says he will take $1 salary as president. By Charlie Spiring. President-elect Donald Trump stood by his promise to reject the presidential salary during an interview with CBS's 60 Minutes. The answer is no, he said, when asked about his campaign trail promised by CBS interviewer Leslie Stahl. I think I have to take by law $1 so I'll take $1 a year. He admitted that he didn't even know what the salary was, but when he was told it was $400,000 salary he declined it. I'm not taking it, he said. He added that he would not be taking too many vacations either. There's so much work to be done and I want to get it done for the people, he said. I want to get it done. We're lowering taxes, we're taking care of health care. Trump signaled that he wanted to bring the people together, urging both the protesters and his supporters to stop abusing each other. Stahl pointed to the recent violence around the country after the election. I am so saddened to hear that. And I say, stop it, he said. If it helps. I will say this, and I will say right to the cameras, stop it. He suggested that many of the protesters were professional and that his supporters would have been excoriated by the media if they refused to accept the election results. There is a different attitude. You know, there is a double standard here, he said. Shtal specifically told Trump that the gay, Muslim, African American, and Latino communities were frightened after he was elected. He replied that the incidents were probably amplified by the press, but he urged Americans to come together. Don't be afraid, Trump said. We are going to bring our country back. But certainly, don't be afraid. Speaking to the entire family, Stahl asked Ike Trump if the campaign had hurt the family's business brand. Ike Trump replied that she didn't think it mattered. Who cares? Who cares? Trump added earnestly. This is big league stuff. This is our country. Our country is going bad. We are going to save our country. I don't care about hotel occupancy. It's peanuts compared to what we're doing. This has been the Trump Breaking News Network. Please subscribe and share to stay up to date on the latest news about our president. Be informed.